My grandfather was born a slave in 1854. He died in 1941, passing on a dream. His oldest son was hanged in 1936 in Georgia for refusing to work overtime and for standing up for his rights. In 1955, a racist white man slit my brother's throat in a hospital in West Virginia where he worked. He was never charged. In 1969, I was hit in the left eye in Dayton, Ohio with a beer bottle by a racist white group. I was blind for over a year. In 1971, I was refused medical treatment for third degree burns and not allowed in a hospital in Alexandria, Virginia because of the color of my skin. In 1998, my nephew's neck was broken by the police in Bluefield, West Virginia. It paralyzed him from his neck down. He was only 18 years old. The police were never charged. My father died in 1965 hoping his children's life would be better than his. We are tired of singing the songs, we shall overcome. We are tired of the I forgive you. We are tired of the injustice. We want justice now. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. To understand the black man's fight, you must first take a look at the black man's plight. To understand our state of mind, turn the pages of history, and there you'll find that this land of the free and home of the brave is where you brought us and made us your slave, and freedom was a dream that we took to our grave. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. At some point you said we were free, but this has never been our reality in your sweet land of liberty. This applied to you, but not to me. We're still waiting to be set free. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. We salute your flag, but for us it's a lie. We died for this country. Somebody tell me why. In this country of freedom and equality, we've been treated like we were the enemy. It's a wake up call. This is a wake up call. What we've endured is hard to define. We have a permanent scar in our hearts and mind. But through it all, we still stand tall. And we refuse to give up and we refuse to fall. It's a wake up call. We'll never be silent, we'll remain outspoken. We're a symbol of endurance and we'll never be broken. Our ancestors died passing on the dream that one day we'd be free, as impossible as it seemed. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. We've held on to our dreams when all seemed lost. Freedom for us has been a very high cost. Things have changed, new laws have been passed, but in the race for equality, we still come in last. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. You have no clue what it's like having the color of my skin because the journey into my world is a place you've never been. If you were born white, you were born free. You'll never know what it's like to be black like me. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. This is a wake up call, America. This is a wake up call. This is a brand new day. Pay attention to what I say. This is a wake up call. This is a wake up call.